Okay, let's talk about uh, parameter maps a little bit more and some advanced functionality under the special parameters options, which allow you to do report indexing of items within your bill of materials. So I'm going to start off by just populating the list of uh, parameters I want to extract from Creo. And you'll notice by default, we put in these uh, two default special parameters for component quantity. I'm going to get rid of, uh, let's get rid of all these just by selecting them and hitting the delete key. I'll get rid of the description also. And now what I'm going to come in and I'm going to scroll down. We've got these new options here. So report index zero. Um, let's go and add also report index one. And then we'll do a null zero and a null one. Whoops. Null zero and null one. There we go. Okay. So when we export these reports, what this is going to do is it's going to add additional counter columns to the bill of materials. And you're probably thinking, why would I want to do this? Well, if you're importing data to MRP system or you're using it to kind of understand the organization and structure of what item is first, second, third, fourth, this can be quite handy. Um, so the full bomb, as you can see, we've added these new columns of information. And the report index zero starts obviously at zero at the top level. Uh, one starts at one, null zero starts at null, which is an empty value, and then starts at zero. And null one starts at null and then starts at one. So those indexes will continue down the list um, uh, to the nth item. And if you go to the full summary bomb, it's basically the same thing. It's just an incrementer of things, but this is a compressed list due to the summary bomb, which uh, brings things down by quantity uh, based on discovery. Uh, the summary bomb is a little bit different in that we this logic is being applied to each subassembly that it comes across. So these in, these indexes that we've had added here are actually repeating for each subassembly being reported in the summary bomb. Uh, the total components bomb will not receive this data because it is a flat structure of all of the components. And also the all params will not receive this data because it is a flat structure of all the components and all of the parameters associated with them. So uh, the it is very handy to have this information. Um, it's it's a new feature that we've added to kind of uh, streamline and minimize the amount of uh, extra processing that needs to be done on some of these uh, uh, files and keep the indexing more specific to its purpose, which is typically for loading data into ERP or MRP.